The weather is humid, the ground is damp, yet the community is alive with the sound of teens interacting with each other. Teens from all over Springfield come to Evangel Temple Youth to learn more about Jesus. Here we are at the doorsteps of Evangel Temple Youth. Let's go on inside and see how they are impacting students day to day. I think it's impacting the community through the life change that's experienced um, on a Sunday morning or Wednesday night and through the events. It's, it's done by um, culture set here, impacting and transforming lives to whenever they're out immersed in culture elsewhere, um, it shows. This purpose of reaching and impacting students for Jesus is not just specific for Evangel Temple youth. It's a necessary thing that all youth groups, ET, um, James River, uh, Life 360, you know, wherever you want to go, um, North Point, I mean, all these different churches are off the top of my head that I'm thinking of. We all need um, to constantly be finding the authentic gospel as a center of um, ministry, and I think sometimes it's really hard um, with, you know, trying to um, perform on stage, get people excited. Um, you know, you hear this whole idea of um, draw people in with entertainment, um, keep them hooked with Jesus. And I really, I think, I genuinely wholeheartedly believe um, that that shouldn't be the heart of, of the church. Now, there seems to be some bit of controversy about youth groups not letting outsiders in. Let's talk to our expert about this and see why this is so and how youth groups can begin to fix this. The biggest reason, in my opinion, for that is because of fear. People are afraid to reach out, they're afraid to meet new people, because it's out of your comfort zone to go and talk to someone you don't know, making small talk or making up a conversation on the spot because you don't know them at all. And so, if you're looking for a youth group, if you're looking for a place and you think it's just a bunch of cliques, a bunch of people that are inclusive, it's not the case on purpose. People are afraid, people are nervous to reach out. And that's what makes, that's a big part of why Christianity is so difficult to follow because it is uncomfortable most of the time if you're doing it right. We talked to a new addition to the youth group and asked what made them stay at the youth group. It was fun and I got to learn even more about the word. It was more for my age and like elementary was. However great a youth group can be, some youth groups might not be for you. Yes, I think that we can um, accommodate to and um, cater to uh, every uh, a good variety of amount of people, but also at the end of the day, um, there's amazing churches out there that can also do the same thing, and uh, we'd be selling them short if we didn't acknowledge that also. Regardless if you come to Evangel Temple Youth or not, Pastors all across Springfield encourage you to go to church and be plugged into one of their communities. For Chief TV, I'm Jacob Harris.